Welcome to linuxhelp.com. For today's topic, I will show you how to configure and test RAID 10. RAID is a redundant array of independent disk. It's a technology that allows storing data across multiple hard drives. The purpose of RAID is to achieve data redundancy, to reduce data loss, and in a lot of cases, improve performance. In the case of RAID 10, is a combination of level 1, which is a uh, then to the mirroring and label zero which is done to the strapping which is why it is also sometimes identified as a rate 10. mirroring is writing data to or more hard drives disk at the same time if one disk fails the mirror image preserves the data from the failed disk so now let's proceed with the configuration process of rate 10 First, I'm going to check uh, install version of OS on my system. My operating system is Red Hat 7.6. Now, let's see the drives which in my system. I have created all the disk file here. On Red 10, I'm using the four disk including SDB, SDC, SDD, and SDE. Now, first of all, I'm going to create partition in the disk using FDisk. Now, define here primary, it's a primary partition. Define as a plus one GB. To define a type of partition, press T. Have the partition. Now write the partition. Like this, we have to create all the drives here. Define the hash code. To create a new partition, give n. Now set is the primary partition. Define the partition space. Now define the type of partition. Write it. Now for the last and SDE partition, new partition. Given as a primary partition, partition define its size one GB. Now all the partition have been created. Let's list all the partition. You can see here the SDB one, SDC one, SDD one. All the partition have been created. Now, after all the partition have been created, now I'm going to apply RAID 10 on these partitions using MDADM command, MDM hyphen capital C for the new RAID level. I'm defining its name as MD0. Now, you have to mention the RAID level. Level is equals to 10 to mention hyphen L. Now define the number of disks you are using, 4. And now list all the drives here. SDB1, 
slash tab hdc1 slash tab hdd1 and slash tab hde1 now rate 10 has been applied on the all the disk now i'm going to format all the rate 10 levels in xt4 format using the mkfs dot ext4 and you have to mention your slash tab slash md0 now i have successfully formatted it now we need to mount it so i'm going to create a new directory here data name now i will mount my rate 10 on this data directory slash md it is already mounted it is already mounted so now check it's mounted or not so we will use df-h it will show slash tab md0 it's mounted so now i am going to create some directories and files inside the data directory Okay, dir it will create some directories and now create files you will see the files and directories have been created now i am going to fail any single drive so that I can verify after that that my files and directories are data loss occur or not. So to fail any drive, I will use command iPhone F slash tab. I am choosing any drive. This is SDB one. Now it is set as a faulty drive. Now to check for data loss occur or not, I am going to long list the, all the files. You will see that all the datas are here. So it verified that in case of a fault of in any hard drive, any disk in the rate 10 configuration, so there will be no data loss. Now I will replace this faulty drive with the new drive which I have already created so I'm going to remove my this drive using mdadm command mdadm slash tab slash md0 hyphen r we will use to remove the drive slash tab the defaulty drive is stb1 you will see here it is removed so now I'm going to add the new drive here. You can see I have created already there ls blk. The HDE HDF drive I have already created with the HDF found partition. To add drive, I will use command mdadm slash tab slash md0 hyphen hyphen add and the partition hd f1 added now we will check details mdadm hyphen hyphen detail slash tab md0 you will see here active devices are 4 and working devices also same as 4 now you can see the active device stf1 is the now new added drive here says all the drive are here so these are the four drives which are configured with the rate 10 so this is the method to configure rate 10 if you like it please subscribe to our channel and also to watch more tutorial please visit our website www.linuxhelp.com and if you have any queries mail us to support at linuxhelp.com